Governor Ron DeSantis says that he is ready to sign the controversial abortion bill. Now, once it becomes law, it would ban the procedure after 15 weeks, and there are no exceptions for rape or incest. NBC 6's Kim Wynn joins us live with reaction tonight. Kim. Yeah, well, Juwan, this bill has been controversial from the very start tonight. Many are reacting to it being passed by lawmakers and now heading to the governor's desk. We're just really upset. Uh, prepared to fight another day. Reaction from abortion rights advocates is pouring in about a bill banning abortions after 15 weeks, which may soon become law. And the fact that Florida is trying to carry this torch to end Roe v. Wade is disgusting. It is something that Floridians did not ask for. State lawmakers approved the item Thursday night in a vote that went down party lines. 23 yeas, 15 nays, Mr. President. The bill would go into effect in July. The only exceptions are to save a mother's life, prevent serious injuries, or if the fetus has a fatal abnormality. There are no exceptions for victims of rape, incest, or human trafficking. These are folks uh, that are being forced to carry pregnancies through trauma. Governor Ron DeSantis is committed to signing it. I think the protections are, are warranted, and uh, I think that uh, we'll, be able to, uh, we'll be able to sign that in short order. Some Republican lawmakers stated their positions. Okay, after 15 weeks, um, that is a child. I was adopted, you know, and I could have been, you know, I could have been on the other side of this argument also. So when you think about being pro-life, um, we're, we're giving 15 weeks. Reaction also coming in from the White House. On Twitter, President Biden called it dangerous, saying it will severely restrict women's access to reproductive health care. He added his administration will not stand for the continued erosion of women's constitutional rights. Some Democrats are calling the bill wrong. There's something just off or wrong about a male-dominated legislative body making a decree like this. Now, if the bill becomes law, experts say that it'll be challenged in court immediately. For now, we're reporting live from Pembroke Pines, Kim Wynn, NBC6 News.